everybody. If today's world, farmers are facing problem, and the major problem is that they cannot put the exact value of water to the soil, to the soil, with the plant needs to grow. That is why today I dance and I system are has made a smart irrigation system. So I would like a dance to continue with the hybrid part. This is the Arduino based irrigation system using solar panel. So with the name we can understand that this solar panels will help the battery to recharge and the motor and the motor we have not put the water pump either than that we have put the motor because because this water pump we can use in large plots of land so l- let me tell you how it happens this is a schematic and this is the block in the schematic we have made our own soil sensor with using darlington pair and in the block as i am telling you we will mo- we will b- connect the bluetooth as we have made the app to the bluetooth and the bluetooth will send signal to the arduino and the arduino will ask the soil moisture sensor that what is the value and if it is less than 200 then it will give reply to the motor pump that it should on the water but if it is more than 200 then the arduino will not give the reply as we have made in the arduino so as i am explaining you you can see the diagram and if any queries you can check the you can reply the video and check it properly so now i will let tusham to explain the software part i am used arduino software for making the codes now i will show you the codes if the sensor value is less than 200 the arduino will pump the soil and if the sensor value is greater than 200 we have to control it manually if the sensor value is greater than 200 it will switch on to the serial dot available part serial dot available part means the serial connection is the serial connection is available or not the serial connection between the arduino and the bluetooth module now i am going to be now i am going to switch the app part so this is the bluetooth list speaker means it will show the list of bluetooth devices and we have to pick one and if the bluetooth is on it will be connected this is the motor button so if the if we click on motor on button the water will be pumped and if we click on the motor off button the water will not pump and if we click on the moisture status it will show show the moisture status here and we have also put the exit button and If we click on the exit button, it will close the app. So now I will explain you the blocks. So we have. So when we click on the app, it will say "Welcome to AI Education System," and we have put text to speech buttons. If if Bluetooth is connected, and if we click on motor button one, that is our on button. Then that it will, and that it will send Bluetooth one, and the color would be green, and button motor off button would be white. And if we click on motor off button, it will send the Bluetooth part zero. And if we click on button three, it will send but it will send X two. Now let us start the app. Welcome to AI irrigation system. Listen this, we can know that this is user friendly. And now let us connect to the Bluetooth. Connected. It is XC05 our Bluetooth model. Bluetooth is connected. We can and as the wet soil, if we give the moisture values. Soil moisture value is 749. This means that it is more than 200. That is why the water will not pump. So, but As I told, we can control it manually. So we have our motor on and off buttons. Motor is on. Motor is off. And here also we can do it. If we remove this, the motor is on because there is no connection. Soil and moisture, soil moisture, soil status, moisture value is zero. Soil moisture value is zero. But zero. if we put in the dry soil, let's see what is the soil moisture value. Soil moisture. Soil moisture value is zero. It's still zero because the water is not there and it is a totally dry soil. 
So it is less than limit so water will be pumped. And now we are exiting the app. Closing AI irrigation system. So this model which we have made can help the many farmers. And if we need to put in the large farms, we need to use Arduino Mega instead of Arduino Uno R3 and one octopopper to put in the large farms. Oh, oh,